So, project 6 ng um, exam 3. Task 1. Apply a tight text wrap around the first image. So, ito yung first image natin. Meron pa tayo second. So, meron tayo second image. Pero ito yung first image natin. And then, i-apply daw natin yung text wrapping na tight. Ayan. Tight. So, click natin yung image. Then, go to picture format contextual tab. And then, under the arrange group, click the wrap text drop down and then i-select natin si tight ayan so yung mga text medyo mas malapit or mas dikit sila dun sa may sa edges no ng ating picture then mark completed task number 2 modify the end note properties by changing the number format to 123 pero wag daw tayong magi insert ng end note okay so papalitan lang daw natin yung prop, uh, end note properties so Pumunta lang tayo kay uh, review Review tab ba yun? Ah, references Okay, references tab And then, kay footnotes group I-click natin itong dialog box ng footnotes And then dito sa footnote and endnote window Select natin sa endnotes And then make sure nakalagay sa end of documents And then yung number format gawin natin 1, 2, 3 So, ang sabi sa instruction Do not insert uh, wag natin i-insert yung end note So, i-apply lang natin Ayan And do not insert an end note So, na-apply na natin Let's check Kung talaga lagay ba Ayan, nailagay naman Okay And then, mark completed Task number 3 Format the 3D model to position in middle left uh, Middle left with square text wrapping So, ito yung 3D model natin Ito. So, yan 3D model siya kasi na i-rotate ko na parang 3D talaga. And then, uh, kay 3D model contextual tab sa taas, yung position uh, yung arrange group position, and then mid, uh, middle left. Ito, middle left with square text wrapping. Okay, and then mark completed. Task 4. At the bottom of the page, add a, at sa pinakababa daw ng page natin, Mag-add daw tayo ng continuous um, continuous cycle diagram. So, ito ay um, smart art. Okay, smart art siya. Tapos, may height na 2.5 inches and a width 6 inches. Position in the bottom center with square text wrapping. Then, change the color of the smart art to colored fill accent 6. I-cut down natin yung mga steps. Ito. Yung mga steps. And isa-isa daw natin siyang i-paste dun sa mga box nung continuous cycle diagram. So, first maglagay muna tayo ng add muna tayo ng continuous cycle diagram. So, uh, punta tayo ng insert tab. Up. First, select muna yung pinaka-bottom of the page. And then, go to insert tab. Then, under the illustrations group, and po si smart art so click smart art select smart art and then sabi cycle daw continuous cycle so hanapin natin si continuous ito yun continuous cycle and then click ok and then uh, change the height daw to 2.5 so iselect natin yung smart art <coughs> hindi yung uh, individual box na. so yung buong smart art so by clicking the border ito and then kay uh, format contextual tab yung height is gawin natin 2.5 inches and then yung width is naka 6 naman na no? so ayan naka 6 na siya and then position in bottom center so dito kay format contextual tab pa din arrange group position so sabi bottom center so, position in bottom center with square text wrapping Ayan. Yan na yun. And then, change the color to colored fill accent 6. So, click ulit natin. Select the smart art graphic. And then, go to smart art design contextual tab. Change color drop down. And then, hanapin natin yung ayan, accent 6. Accent 6, colored fill. Ito. Colored fill accent 6. And then, isa-isa daw natin i-paste. I-cut and i-paste sa bawat box yung mga steps dito so syempre alam naman natin yung pinakauna dyan yung number 1 is ito 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 okay? 
So, yung step 1 dito sa 5 steps. So, gamit po yung control X, shortcut key. Ayan, control X, and then, i-paste natin dito, control V. So, yung susunod din, ganun. Ah, ito, insert seedling, control X, cut. Then, control V. Then, yung susunod, control X. Control V. Then, X. Then, ayan, na-move na yung uh, ating smart art sa first page. Control V and then yung last one, Control X then Control V. So ayan, ayan and then mark completed. Task five, embed fonts in the document to make it easier to share. So iko configure ulit natin yung word natin. So file, more, and then options. Okay, so dito sa ating save, yan. So, hanapin natin ito si Preserve Fidelity when sharing this document. So, i-embed daw natin. Embed funds in the file. And then, okay natin. Then, mark completed.